hey guys so today is my big day it is the day of the epic interview and the girl is so nervous but um i know i'm gonna kick ass i know i'm gonna kick ass <laughs> I have a glass of water here just to you know have a sip when the questions get a bit too hard and you know you need like a moment to think about the answer <laughs> yeah I'm kidding but anyway I'll catch up with you later on hello hello I'm Somnida Okay guys, I was just tasting my mic. Okay guys, I was just tasting my mic. Hello. How are you? Sorry, I can hear you, but I can't see you. Sorry about that. That's okay. Here we are. Sorry. Uh, there you go. Hi. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Hi, good. Thank you for asking. But um, in all my other uh, travel experiences, I think one of the other culture shocks I got when I was in Cambodia, um, I remember in the Khmer Rouge, people did not have food to eat and they resorted to eating insects. So the one day we were traveling in a place called Tarantula Town where the locals ate tarantulas. And I was like, I'm not eating a tarantula. We don't do that in South Africa. We don't play around with animals. <laughs> Come on. Do it! Oh, it's so hairy! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! You have to try. Oh. Do it! Everyone else did it! If I scream, you're gonna take it off. Yeah. This one you get a picture. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> <They're not moving. laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> take it off! Okay, wait. But then I remembered that because I was in a different country, I actually have to do how they do in Cambodia. And look, I decided to have one. And I was like, let me experience it. it. Oh, it was crunchy. The legs were delicious. <laughs> they were crunchy and flavorsome. My goodness. That was I'm quite actually delicious. very familiar with <laughs> that. Oh, <laughs> uh, is it? Um, my actually my relative lives there so the same incident happened where i was thrown a tarantula so yeah and I had it, it, you've tried it i have and i've had it crawl up my arm as well Ah, oh, precious little things man <laughs> red yellow can you say yellow for me is there anything we should know about your criminal record no, not that I know of, unless somebody forged something in my name. Um, Maneso Pagam Samnida, is that it? Yes, yeah. you got it, yes. Yes, come Samnida, thank you so, so much. It was a pleasure right, having was, a conversation with you. It was lovely to meet you today, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Thank you, you too. Gaseo. Bye. Bye. Yo! I don't know how I did, but this girl's got to give me this. I mean, this is close to 50 minutes. <sighs> I think I have this. Guys. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I think I have this. Hey, this is mine. Anyway, let me go and see my mama. By the way, guys, this is my mom's blouse. Mm -mm. I think I need to go for a celebratory breakfast or something because yo. Tell her go to hey yeah. <laughs> yo, I had the best interview ever. She is so friendly and yo guys, like I've made so many mistakes that I picked up, but <sighs> I hope she will forgive me, you know, and she'll understand that girl is new when girl is nervous but i can bring it <laughs> anyway guys let me go
Hey guys, so I was arriving at Hyperlife to get my COVID test done with Ampath. Okay. Oh, yeah. Thank you for sure. but stable, but <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness. Guys, it wasn't so bad. Like you guys like to exaggerate. Like, oh my gosh, COVID test, this long earbud in my nose. It wasn't so bad. So now we go and shop some more. Telling you, there's so much happening. <sighs> there we go. Let's go and shop. I'll catch up with you guys in a day's time when I have to board that flight. Bye. Guys, I really had to go overboard with meds because I did not want to take any risks whatsoever. So I've put my stuff in these vacuum bags. I don't know if they really work. But we are going to try it out. We're going to put this baby in and then see what happens. Because I don't even want to show you my bags, guys. What a mess. But if I can get these items in, right? Guys, I have never done this one before with food. So let's see. Oh my gosh. It's working. Yeah, it is working. I think this is as far as it can go. No, the air's coming out. So I need to keep the closing. Let me put my phone down. So this is what I have done with 90% of my clothes. So I'm on my way to the airport. I'm a bit late. I've already said my goodbyes and yeah, man. I'm late, guys. Oh, it's too really late. We had to check in. I'm looking for something that I cannot find. Yeah. The reason why I have two is because my US visa is in this one so I might want to take like a short lift to the US when I'm that side and this is the new one so you have to travel with both of them. My luggage is overweight. <laughs> Guys, excess baggage. My bags are over by 3.9. That one as well. And now I have to pay 2,400 rand. Hey guys, so we have made it. Here's the big baby. Let me show you. The A380. Big baby we're going on. Where's everyone else? I'm so excited. Cannot wait to get a glass of something, something. Anyway, here's my visa. Sorted. I'll... I'll give you more content when I get in. So thank you. Nice passport. Oh, thank you so much. Hi 
guys, so my mirror fell in through here and now it's broken. I'm trying to get Abby to retrieve it for me, but I ain't winning. Please like and subscribe. Ooh, Wait a second. Is this liquid for my eyelashes? Oring when I live. Oring. What is Levi saying? Are the way I the, the time by the time I land, what's gonna happen? There's no way. I never. Uh, uh, oh my gosh, thanks. I never arrive on the other side looking different, babe. I've mastered this. I'll never shame. We can tell like you saw. I give it to How when I get her, it takes a maga to let you back yak. A what? A what? Of course. So we were given like a hot snack. I think it was an apple pie. I don't quite remember. This was then obviously a muffin, some water, pineapple, and yes, mini cheddars. I'm seated in my extra legroom seat. I mean, I was really disappointed with Emirates for serving me beef eater. What happened to proper gin? Hello guys, so we have arrived at Dubai International Airport, as you can see. I'm just uh, waiting for everyone to get their bags and stuff. I'm going to wait for about 10 minutes or so and then I'll obviously disembark. Um, I broke my nail. I don't know. We are disembarking. Oh, this aircraft is so filthy. Goodness me. I have arrived. It's hot. It's really hot. Yeah. It's hot. She's fanning herself, but she's got a nice warm thick yeah, <laughs> about to have my first Korean dish, kimchi. Hey guys, so, oh guys, my makeup looks so smudged, but you know what? We managed to keep the lashes on. Yeah, that's We it. are, we did, isn't it? Yep. That's several guys. Hi. So, we are landing in Incheon, just now at my home. She's home. <laughs> <laughs> We're landing shortly. It is oh hot, look at that. It is so hot here, but we are gonna land in South Korea. And young as a We are in Incheon, we are at the airport. Oh, okay. Hey guys, it is approximately 8 p.m. We've just checked into our hotel. We arrived at 5, 5.30, but there was a delay. Don't mind my finger, guys. Broke my nail while searching for my bank card. So we've just checked in and I am pushed. I'm hungry, but I'm just so tired. So I don't know if I'm gonna go down to go and find something to eat. The hotel restaurant looks like it's already closed. 
so I might just be left with my buddy over here but yo, it was a mission trying to get like three bags so it's three three two large suitcases and one carry-on and a laptop bag and like documents folder like my muscles are in pain so there was so much picking up of these things i don't even know i feel like i was hit by a bus i'm so tired i'm really exhausted i need to actually take off this wig and yeah man shower but for now this is me signing out until the next time at orientation and we'll see how things go good night